Hey boys, welcome back to some more Cricket 19 Korea and they're back for more. The Blues, they're back for more. We uh, we had a dominant victory last up against them. Personally, we didn't really do much. We <laughs> got a golden duck in the first innings. We got 50 in the second innings, but uh, no wickets. Probably like five bowl uh, five overs bowled in the whole match and it was a resounding victory. So, you know, it's good, it's good to see the boys putting in a, in a stellar performance, a stellar team performance without us sort of carrying the ship, which is, it's happened a couple of times. As uh, the Blues there. Who is that captain? Is that Peter Neville? It sort of looks like Neville. I might be mistaken. I didn't actually see their team list, but uh, it looked like him. Um, is it, he is there, Peter Neville. I'm pretty sure that it looked like him. Um Neville, honestly, he's the one guy that I actually think was pretty unlucky to be originally dropped from the Australian cricket team. <laughs> um, as uh, we come on the ball pretty early here, but uh, yeah, I, I honestly really liked Neville as uh, as a player. He was an excellent keeper. Like he was at the time, I think he was like the best keeper in the country, and he put his batting was like decent. Like he he, he definitely. It was sort of around that time where, you know, Australia was pretty, pretty poor. But, you know, some of his, his contributions were pretty solid. And I thought he was a little hard done by to be dropped. But, you know, Tim Payne, is, he's done a good job. I know a lot of people sort of discredit uh, Payne. But uh, and I, I think the main reason for that is just because a guy like Alex Carey has come onto the scenes and... You know, I'm sort. Of, I am of the opinion, like most people, that I think Carey should be the keeper, as this is extremely close, and it's given to. <laughs> oh boy, first wicket fallen, and uh, that was just. It, I I don't think that was a slider. I think that was just a genuine, genuine leggy, but it just didn't. Uh, it didn't really grip. Obviously, uh, a fresh first day pitch, first morning pitch ball pretty new so just sort of slid on and uh and probably canning into cannoning into off stump um but yeah Alex Carey he's uh you know he's a he's a future star um you know I would love to see them pick him because I think I think Bain I, th I think his time is done as it's gonna be another huge wicket Ryan Gibson trying to play back to a uh it was a reasonably short delivery he actually just spun it he gripped a little bit and uh there's sort of the uh the variances with our with our bowling um look at the pose from gibson um uh, but uh what a what a bit of spell of bowling this is two wickets two for none two for none into our six over there has not been a run scored off us with two wickets, they have scored some runs now. Two for ten into our thirteenth over, but good lord, that was uh, that was beautiful bowling. One that just slid on, hit him in front, and then the second one just gripped a little bit, snuck through. As uh, this one pretty close again, I think it's just probably a little bit high, might have been missing off stump, but uh, worth a worth a good shout nonetheless. As uh, that's a pretty decent shot. Um, but yeah, get, just finishing off on that point, Carey, I'd love to see him come into the side, you know, Tim Payne, he, you know, the Ashes is done now, I think it's, t I think it's time to move on, as this is going to be another wicked fall, and every time, every time I want to finish the point, we just, uh, we bowl a beauty, get a wicket, and, uh, yeah, this is fantastic stuff, just a little tickle, nice catch from Jimmy Pearson, and, uh, that's going to be our third our third wicket. We haven't got a fifer, which is surprising. We've got a lot of threefers, a couple of fourfers, but uh, we're in with a good shot here. Three for 19. That one house missed everything. It snuck between bat and pad. Nathan Lyon didn't even realize we're bowling to the uh, to the other spinner here. As again, <laughs> we're going up for everything. It's exciting times. We'd love to get the fifer here. Jack Edwards, uh, Nathan Lyon. That one, what is happening? It's gonna be out. <laughs> the keeper, what? How is this out? I think it's caught behind. I think, yeah. Big edge. Jimmy Pearson. He, he ricochets it up, and then I, he just. <laughs> he, it, well, this is a better angle. Yeah, he got it. He just snuck it there. 
<laughs> Nathan Lyons furious, but uh, we'll take it, dude. As uh, there we go, four for nineteen. This is brilliant stuff. In with a fantastic chance, Ben Dwarshus into the crease, bowling to the last two batters here. Unfortunately, we're not going to get it. <laughs> Unbelievable, dude. We had such a golden, a golden opportunity to get the five for. Just, uh, just couldn't get it done. We didn't get the opportunities. We come out to bat here, twelve fifties, three, three big ones, and uh, we, uh, we still trail by thirty-five, even with our fantastic bowling efforts. They put in an okay score, um, you know, not huge, but uh, I mean, we're two for two hundred and nine, so we're we're doing, we're going pretty well, and we're gonna have a fairly sizable. Jeez, that was uh. That was a poor shot. <laughs> Very poor shot. Could have got out easily to uh, to Nathan Lyon, who's picked up a couple of wickets himself. Obviously, uh, you know, a bit of a spinner's game at the minute. You know, first innings, both spinners doing a doing a pretty good job here. Um, but yeah, we're, we're going to go with a, with a good size. We'll lead. Hopefully, we can uh, contribute nicely. And uh, we we can't we can't lay bat on ball against. Uh, against Gary here, um, and another wicket has fallen, uh, Lava Shane, yeah, Lava Shane was the man to depart, brings, uh, Sam Hazlitt to the crease, the young fella, young lefty, very, uh, very, you know, good talent, um, I think he's gone pretty well in, in first class cricket as of late, I think anyway, I thought, I thought he's been, uh, scoring some, some pretty handy runs. As uh, Moses on Reeks, who did pick up the man, Larby Shane, is that is a beautiful shot, just driven, driven on the up again. On Reeks is sort of that uh, that nice pace around the one, around the one thirty. It's not express, but it does come onto the bat nicely, and uh, you know it gives you a nice bit of time to see where it's coming as well. As that one again, just uh, oof, direct hit, not not too far away from uh, from a run out there. As, uh, we still trail by 19. We just want to knock those 19 off and then try to set up our uh, our lead. As that is just a glorious shot. Just stand and deliver. Don't even move. No no need to run for that one. Look at this. Beautiful. With the spin. A bit of a risky shot. Could catch the edge, but lovely. Is that that's even better, dude? That was that is a short wide delivery and it's dispatched with uh with just ease. You know, it deserved to get hit. And uh, we obliged beautifully. As again, the outlook, beautiful weather. Shouldn't be interrupted by rain or any sort of other weather. So good stuff. As this one is flicked away nicely again. It's a fairly a fairly offside dominant field, which you know makes sense with the with the spin going away from us. But uh, don't want to don't want to stray too far or too close to the stumps or too close to the pads with uh, with the way we've been. The way we've been striking them. I mean, last uh, last video, last game was a little bit of a an anomaly for us. We, uh, you know, we we did get the 150, but it, it definitely wasn't our most polished performance. We struggled a little bit to get going um, in the first innings. We didn't even get going, so <laughs> you know, we we maybe a little bit of a little bit of a form slump. You know, for our for our career mode so far, it's probably as close to a form slump as we've been in so you know we'd love to we'd love to put on a, a good score here and and just get that get that confidence back because again we, we're looking we're looking good i gotta be honest we're looking extremely good as facing you know I, facing line is a is a, a completely different assignment and much tougher but jason sanger here it's not even i wouldn't even say it's that bad of bowling but we're just we're timing it sweetly. It just seems to be coming onto the bat beautifully. Is uh, as line now is coming, uh, it's coming around the wicket. A bit of a uh, bit of a strange angle, and we are just going to uh, to absolutely dispatch a uh, a pretty rank delivery coming around the wicket. You can sort of understand it. Try to get that drift and angle away. If it's spinning big, it makes sense. But you know where he's. First couple of balls, bit of an indication he's not he's not quite landing them where he would like to around the wicket. As an <laughs> Jason Zanger, he's trying around the wicket again here. He uh, he tried in the last uh, last game. This one is swept. We didn't really use the sweep shot too much last game, but um, 
you know, probably here at the, uh, the SCG, probably the boundaries are, you know, probably a little bit, a little bit bigger. So we do have to be a little bit, a little bit more careful trying to go for that big heave ho over the square leg. So the sweep shot is, uh, is a pretty good option. And again, uh, you know, what's the, what's the, what's the planning here? I, I don't, I don't understand this, this plan. Um, it, it looks like it's just bowling for a, for a loose shot. It's bowling for a miss hit, um, two wides in a row. What's doing? <laughs> Who knows? As this time we flick it away, almost, <laughs> it actually almost drew the false shot and a, and a wicket, but I don't, I just, I don't agree with the plan. Um, I'll take it on any any day of the week. They can keep bowling it there, but I don't think it's uh, I don't think it's the right idea. As the lead has reached 19, myself and uh, and Wildermuth is the new new man to the crease. I actually don't <laughs> I don't know when uh, Young Hazlitt got out, but that's a, that's another good shot. Just late cutting that one. Probably only going to get the single because uh, we were sort of way back in our crease. So. Uh, you know, good shot for for only a for only a single there. Is this one again? Swept powerfully that time. You know, not not a bad line, just just a little bit too full. We we're able to to get on top of that one, and uh, there's there's a huge huge bit of space out there. What is this? <laughs> we we've, we've missed out on a on a bad one there, but I mean. It was it was so wide. Jason Stanger, he's all over the shop. I'm I'm surprised. I'm surprised he's kept bowling. Honestly, we've been we've been just making a mockery of his of his bowling. <laughs> this one again is just whipped nicely. Probably going to settle for the two. Um, but yeah, he's uh he's gone the he's gone the journey. Um, probably you'd have to think this would be his last over if he doesn't. Uh, doesn't get a little bit of a breakthrough. We're on to 39 off 32. Nicely, uh, nicely batted here. Wildermuth is uh, just getting his inning started. As Dwarsh just now comes in, the left hand quick, which, uh, I've, yeah, in the, on the game, I, I do find the left handers to be a little bit of a, a little bit of a tricky, uh, tricky situation for us. Just that angle across, um, Find it a bit more, a bit more difficult. That is not difficult at all. Just a swivel pull shot, 97 meters. Don't mind if I do. Beautiful shot. Um, but the short balls with the left hand is also going to be a little bit dicey because the angle across we can easily just get outside our body a little bit. Um, and uh, you know it can be a little bit of a tougher task trying to line up the. Uh, line up the ball over the wicket for a right hander it just seems it just seems easier to line up whereabouts it's going to end up is this this one, it's a perfect example oh my goodness that is that is the best example we could have just got out on just the angle across here we try to go over square leg again but it just it got big on us and it was also wide outside off and just the top edge straight to fine leg down his throat so out for 47. We didn't even give it the 50. So very, very frustrating right there. Um, but we will be back for the second part or the second innings of this match. Hopefully you guys are enjoying the series. Make sure to like and comment and I'll see you in the next one.